Upload files. There are two ways of adding documents, such as presentations or word processed files, to your course. One method is dragging and dropping, as we've seen in another video. This next method uses Moodle's Activity Chooser and File Picker to upload files. Both methods require us to enable Edit Mode. Then, in the section where we'd like to upload the document, we click the plus sign, add an activity or resource. This brings up the Activity Chooser. A document is considered a resource, so we need to select File. Name is important because it's what students will see on the course page when accessing the file. The description is also important. You may or may not want to include one, but if you do, and you'd like it displayed on the course page, tick the box. Then, under Select Files, if your browser allows, it's possible to drag the file straight into the Upload area. However, we are going to click Add, which takes us to Moodle's File Picker, explored in another video. As we're just uploading a document, we'll ignore the other options for now. Click to browse for the file you want, select it, and then change its name, optional, change the author name, optional, change the license if you're not happy with the default one, note this won't appear on the main course page, click upload this file to proceed. It's worth exploring additional settings, such as those under Appearance. You can display the file size, useful if your students have slow internet connections, display the file type, show when it was uploaded. Let's enable those options. To alert course participants that you've added the file, tick Send Content Change Notification. Now, if we save and return to course, we can see our file displayed on the page along with its information.